That's right. We're learning more information tonight about the pilot, the suspect. He's a husband, a father of two who lives in the San Francisco Bay Area. What we don't know is what would motivate him to allegedly try and bring down an air carrier full of passengers. Crisis making an emergency landing ETA four minutes. A mid-air takedown averted. The drama unfolding inside the cockpit of Alaska Airlines Flight 2059, operated by Horizon Air. The SF-bound flight took off from Everett, Washington Sunday night, but had to be diverted to Portland. Air traffic control describing the situation. The jump seat pilot, who is the extra pilot, they, they give a ride, trying to shut down the engine. The off-duty pilot identified as 44-year-old Joseph Emerson. Authorities say Emerson was seated in the flight deck jump seat when he allegedly tried to disrupt the engines mid-flight. The crew quickly responding, stopping him and securing the aircraft. Just to uh, give you a heads up, we've got the uh, guy that tried to shut the engines down uh, out of the cockpit. The commercial pilot, a resident of Pleasant Hill, located in Northern California. Neighbors are in disbelief. He seemed happy, fine doing things and no problems at all. And we still can't believe it. We're still shocked. Um, doesn't sound like Joe at all. I don't know what happened to him mentally that he would do something like that. Emerson was taken into custody upon landing and booked on more than 160 charges, including 83 counts of attempted murder, along with reckless endangerment and endangering an aircraft. This is really the craziest thing I remember in a long, long time. Uh, and it's very sad that this was basically an ins inside job. Ross Amer, an aviation expert, has flown in the cockpit numerous times. This is what the cockpit looks like, the jump seat behind the two pilots. The red tabs above are the fire handles that the FAA says Emerson attempted to deploy to shut the engines down. Had he done that, it would have been disastrous. The pilots did the perfect job because we're trained to take the danger, uh, the threat out of the cockpit. And thankfully, nobody was injured during this incident. Emerson is scheduled to make his first court appearance tomorrow. We're live in Burbank, Carlos Salcedo, KTLA 5 News. Carlos, thank you.